Hello and welcome for a new unboxing sequence here on The Watchers TV and today we have something really special and different to share with you. So I guess you guys know that it's my uh, birthday again, like every month actually. So let's immediately start with some proper unwrapping of this huge and rather heavy present. Oh. As you can see, massive cardboard box uh, to start with. And now look at this uh, kind of very crazy bullet shaped case that we have here. So this uh, crazy uh, shaped box is made out of aluminium. Uh, it's pretty nice, nice to, uh, to touch. So let's now open it. And to do so, well, you need to press uh, this uh, button, uh, like on a regular bullet uh, that uh, the place to ignite uh, the explosion. But here it releases an, an open-close uh, mechanism. Ta-da! And actually, this is a timekeeping device. So personally, I'm no particular gun enthusiast, but I have to say uh, that this object looks pretty damn cool. And just as a side note, historically and based on their micro-mechanical know-how, there has been quite a few suppliers of the watchmaking industry which have manufactured the small components that could be found in guns and other weapon-related uh, objects. But uh, let's go back uh, to this unboxing of the day. As you can see, I mean, this is a pretty cool object and it's the first one presented by the Unnamed Society, kind of a new brand which will specialize in developing and producing very original gifts Always unique object, and this one has been developed uh, with the team of Lippe 1839, that's the company uh, specialized in producing amazing clocks, and you must be already quite familiar with that name on the Watches TV, since for instance they are the ones uh, coming with uh, exceptional timekeepers with uh, MVNF, such as our good friend over there, Balthazar, standing proudly here at the Watches Club, and always overlooking what we do. Okay, so let's uh, dig a bit deeper with this cult, and uh, let's place it on its pedestal. To do so, you actually have uh, two options. Uh, you can either place it uh, vertically like this. And uh, the time reading information is just in front of you uh, in uh, what uh, mimics kind of the place where you would load your bullets. You have two domed uh, shaped discs, one with the hour and the upper one uh, for the minutes and you can enjoy the, the movements construction uh, nicely. Uh, it's a movement made out of 142 components, uh, gear trains, uh, regulating organ on top uh, and a large single barrel offering you eight days of power reserve and all the parts, I mean, are really beautifully finished uh, and polished. But uh, by taking this small metal ring that you place also in the same place, well now you can uh, place it horizontally more or less and it gives you just another experience uh, with the object. I do like that you have uh, both these options. Uh, so how do you set the time and how do you wind it? Uh, well, actually, it's pretty easy, but I will put it back in the vertical position. It will make this so much easier for myself. So to set the time, it's actually quite easy. You just need your hand to do this and you just turn around the, uh, the minute uh, disc. And as you can see, the hour revolves also. So obviously, if you need to change uh, 11 hours, it might take you a little bit of time, but that's just fine. Okay, to wind the watch, uh, this is pretty cool, and this is the first time I'll be able to say this, but to wind the barrel, you actually have to put this key inside the gun's actual barrel, just like this. And you just wind it. Isn't that noise just pretty cool and suited for this piece? Really like it, actually. So the, the, the frame of the gun is made out of uh, brass, which is nickel and palladium plated, and either polished and satin finished or sunblasted, and the entire object weighs 3.6 kilogram. So the grip is also quite nice and quite special, and in this case it's made out of cow horn. It feels pretty comfortable in your palm, but as the unnamed society revealed, there will be different versions made. I mean, overall 50 of these uh, Colts will be produced, but each one will be unique pieces, uh, special materials used, uh, special engraving. And one nice little uh, feature uh, is that you can actually pull the trigger on this one and shoot. Uh, quite nice little sound there, it has no other functional reason than being playful. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this uh, special unboxing, always a pleasure to do. 
And if you're interested in purchasing uh, such a piece or have one customized for you, well, it might be a bit difficult to find it at your local dealer, but you can always ask us and we'll just make the contact. So just for info, the price uh, starts around 30,000 US dollars and depending on customization, well, price will of course increase. So all the very best to you, see you real soon. I will now uh, go out and scare a few people outside should get me arrested in no time, but then, viva watchmaking!